Hey Grubbers, welcome back to my channel. Thank y'all so much for joining me again today. Happy Tuesday. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. I hope y'all had a wonderful weekend. As you can see, you guys, we have the Impossible Whopper today. Oh, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. Also hit that post notification bell beside the subscribe button below so you can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, welcome to all my new subbies. Thank you so much for joining me, my new grubbers. I'm gonna go ahead and get into this food, you guys. We have the Impossible Whopper and I am starving. I know I say that every video, but it's true. And I got on the Impossible Whopper hats, y'all. They are not paying me, although they can cut me a check. Um, yeah, and the Impossible Whopper t-shirt, but... Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and get into it, you guys. Today I just have some onion rings, um, the Impossible Whopper with cheese, and I just have some water over here. And I have this zesty... Um, sauce I don't know how this tastes I got some um, backup ranch just in case for my onion rings yeah how are you guys doing how was your weekend what do you guys do yeah let me know in the comments how you like this setup because I'm trying to get a better setup to where you can see the food and not so much other stuff you know so just let me know how it looks um yeah let me know how it looks let me make sure they got it right because i'm gonna go ahead and take the first bye Mm. It's good. It tastes just like meat, just like I expected. The texture is a bit different, but mm. It's good. So, it's an all plant based meat. I'm assuming it's something like the Beyond Burger. I also, in this video, I want to give a special shout out and a thank you again to It's Squeaky. for inviting me to fish fry friday thank you so much squeaky shout out to it squeaky you guys go ahead over to her channel and check her out she is awesome mm -mm. that got um horse reddish in it and i can taste it kind of strong so I'm gonna go ahead with my ranch I knew so bring my ranch does anyone else like ranch on their um onion rings I like ranch and I'm also gonna give a shout out to Bailey Bailey is one of my Instagram supporters hey Bailey she is so sweet y'all I hope you're having a good summer, Bailey, and staying out of trouble. Mm. <laughs> As I get older, I find myself telling kids to stay out of trouble all the time. <laughs> like, stay out of trouble. Don't do nothing I wouldn't do. But yeah, shout out to Bailey. She's a sweetheart, y'all. Has anyone tried this Impossible Whopper? Am I late to the party again? Mm. Mm. 
As y'all notice, I don't have my grill pan on. It's too hot. It's too hot. But I do have my trusty fan. My fan gonna be here all summer 19. All summer 19, this fan will be with me. Cause it is so hot. I haven't had Burger King in so long. Been years since I had Burger King. Well, a Whopper, let me say that. Um, and I got this, y'all. I don't know if I told y'all in another in another video, but it was the Impossible Whopper tour that came through. Um, it was going, you know, from city to city like a van, and they was giving out hats, shirts. Mmm, those onion rings are good. Hat shirts, um, pins, gift cards for the Impossible Whopper. So that's why I got all this attire from. And on this burger, guys, I just got give y'all a bite. I don't know if you can see it. Is it focused? But it has everything on it. Lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, cheese, onions. I think I got extra pickles on this one. Mmm. And I was gonna get or ask them to do keto, but I've never had keto sandwich at Burger King. Does Burger King do keto? You know how they wrap the sandwich up in lettuce? I figured they wouldn't know what I was talking about or they would have messed it up, so. I just got bread and I think, I think I put extra cheese. I was doing too much with this Whopper. <laughs> Way too much. So y'all, this weekend, I did go to see Ma. Y'all know I've been talking about this movie for weeks. And, um, I'm just going to give my opinion on it. Not a spoiler alert. Well, maybe. It's just going to be my opinion on the movie. Damon Wayans hated it. Hated it. It got no snaps. No snaps. I hated it. But, I did see a lot of reviews and a lot of people enjoyed the movie. I personally hated it. Mm. You know how you see a movie and you be like, it had so much potential in my opinion. So much potential. But yeah, y'all, this tastes just like meat. You cannot tell the difference. Like I said, the texture is a little hard, and maybe because they overcooked it.
But it got that char grill taste to it. Yeah. I can dig it. You know, I should have known this sauce was nasty because she tried to basically, well, she gave it to me. She was like, um, I asked her what sauces do they have for the, I feel like I'm yelling. Okay. Anyways, I asked her, now I'm whispering. <laughs> I asked her what sauces they had for the, um, the onion rings. I was waiting on her to give me a rundown, you know, ranch, honey mustard. She gave me one choice, zesty. I should have known then it was nasty. Mm. I forget somewhere today. I'm trying to see if I got food on my face. But anyway, I read somewhere today where KFC is going to be selling chicken skin. Just the skins, no meat. Would y'all try that? I would. I'd try it. Try anything twice. Anything twice. <laughs> But just the skin, I just found that odd. Like, how do they come up with this stuff? And then, also, KOC is supposed to have some kind of meatless chicken or meatless meat. Not doing too much. Y'all, yeah. there's a lot going on out here in these YouTube streets. Between today and yesterday, it's a lot of tea being spilled, a lot of tea being drank. It's just a whole lot, a whole lot of. But. I hope everything works out. If y'all haven't tried ranch on y'all um, onion rings, try it. It's good. I won't lie about that. really hit the spot it really hit the spot beyond meat burgers y'all burger king watch mcdonald's gonna come behind them and do it too but i bet mcdonald's get like a partnership with beyond meat i did call this the beyond meat burger it's not beyond meat it's just impossible i don't know what's so impossible about it though are they saying it's impossible because it's impossible that it can't be meat it tastes I don't know but I bet McDonald's get a partnership with Beyond Meat Burgers watch
Mm. I was really impressed with this. Really impressed. I think this burger costs like five dollars by itself. I don't know what's the difference between that price and the Whopper price because I haven't bought a regular Whopper in so long. But that's a good choice for um, vegetarians. Y'all know what? <laughs> when I ordered this burger, I was going to add bacon to it. But I'm like, no, that would defeat the purpose because it's supposed to be all meatless. Y'all, I was about to get bacon, extra bacon at that. Whoa, Nelly, slow down. I was about to ruin the whole experience. But I really just wanted to eat today. I had nothing to talk about. I really just been rambling as usual, but. I'm so glad y'all came to eat with me today. And again, welcome to all my new subscribers, my new grubbers. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. You guys head over to Instagram. Follow me over there at She Grubs With Love. Follow me on Twitter as well as She Grubs. Grubs with two Bs. And, um... Am I on anything else? I'm on Snapchat, y'all. I just cannot get it. I cannot get the hang of Snapchat. I cannot get the hang of Twitter. I can't get the hang of looking in this lens instead of over there at my viewfinder. I can't get a lot of stuff. I, I'm just I'm just out here, y'all. But thank y'all so much for joining me. And until the next video, continue to grow up with love. Peace.